Hey guys, Professor Prime here with MeasurePlanet.com and today in What's in the Box is a, is a little different video than I normally do when it comes to these uh, What's in the Box videos. As you can see, I have an Amazon package here and the reason I have it, it's opened already. Uh, funny story. So I ordered some new figures on Amazon a couple last week. Those figures were supposed to be delivered yesterday as of on Wednesday and it was delivered to the wrong house. So I contacted Amazon and said, hey, they're delivered to the wrong house. What, what can I do about it? And they were like, well, we can do replacement or refund. I was like, well, I prefer replacement because if you do a refund, I'm just gonna just purchase the items again. So the, the replacement will be a lot easier. So they did the replacement, which I'm beginning tomorrow of me recording this video. So that will be on Wednesday. Today is Tuesday, February 6th that I'm recording this video. And I get home and lo and behold, there's a package at my door and I go, oh, that's weird. It was supposed to be here tomorrow. It showed up early. So I get it and I look at the package and I'm like, well, there's no, this is the original package. So I wanna just, whoever got, whoever got my package whether picked up my package at their door I want to thank you so much for being a good Samaritan and either a bringing it to my house and dropping it off which if you did that that's awesome and two you gave it you either took it back to the mail office and say hey this was delivered to the wrong house can you please get this to the right house to which point the mail people brought it to the right house so I don't know what happens but I contacted Amazon and then Amazon told me that I could keep the package wait what so I based on whatever what the item is but I was like, yeah, uh, how do I return when I get the replacements? Where do I go to, where do I need to take that to send it back to you? And they were like, it's yours. You know, sorry for the inconvenience. Uh, you will not be double charged for this. Uh, thank you. Any, thank you. We appreciate it. Thank you for letting us know, but go ahead and keep it. Which means I have I'm going to have tomorrow when I, if, if, if it shows up, if it doesn't show up, I ain't going to worry about it. If it gets delivered to the wrong house again, I ain't going to worry about it. And there is a reason why I have God King Oger in the background here, because one, it's freaking cool. And two, we got some King Oger stuff in here. So we're gonna go over the King Oger stuff first. Uh, so this is the, uh, so just so you guys know, this is not fully King Oger. I'm missing two figures and this is one of them. It, I picked up on Amazon. So this one turns into the ball and chain, which is supposed to attach back here. I got that. So there's that guys. The other thing is I'm gonna get some slack for this. I did a video a long time ago. I think it was in 2021. I used to do movie reviews on this channel. I will be doing movie reviews now on My Dream Planet at the Movies. It's a new channel that I made. Check it out. I'll probably put a link in this video for it, but Masters of the Universe Revelation came out in 2021 and I did not like it. I did find some of it entertaining, but overall, like, I just, I don't know, maybe it was the hype, just hating on it because it was bad, you know, because they said it was a He-Man show and it was a Tila show. I, I just, I just, I don't know, I didn't like it as much, but then, like, part two came out and I thought part two of Revelations was a lot better. I felt like it played a lot better. I felt like it was a lot smoother. I felt like we had more dynamic with the characters. I think overall, I think part of it was, like, my hype for what He-Man was, what was it gonna be and what it end up being like my expectations were out there and then I listened too much to all the hater and I just joined the bag wagon. Here's the thing I have to understand too that when I grew up with He-Man the, the demographic of people that watch cartoons or like you know to sell toys was vastly different than it was today. Whereas back then He-Man was like 52, 55 episodes long. Revelations was like six episodes, eight episodes. They weren't very long. The, the attention span of people is dramatically changed from back. Uh, Revolution just came out on Netflix a couple of weeks ago, I think it was. And I did watch it and I loved it. I thought it was great. So great, in fact, that I've actually started ordering figures. And I ordered uh, the Tila figure, the uh, Sorceress Tila. Uh, the, the head sculpt is not the greatest. I love the packaging, by the way. But yeah, that was the other the other item that I, I had ordered. The thing is, is like, it's, as funny as this is, I actually did pick up Evelyn from, from the, the Evelyn from the first show, uh, Revelations. I did pick up that, that one. I haven't opened her yet. I did get her because I got her on clearance. And I also did get Skella God too. And I picked him up on clearance as well. So it's not like I haven't bought any of the figures from the new show, but Mr. J, I think, has gone all in. He bought a lot of them. I, I think I said to him, I said, I'm not going to buy them because I don't want to support the show. And here I am buying it. So Mr. J, if you see this video, but yeah, I, I, I'm going to get the uh, Prince Adam and I'm probably going to see if I can hunt down the He-Man from the show. I don't know if I'll get the Battle Cat though, because that's still kind of expensive. I might still get that. I, I don't know yet. But yeah, I got I got Tila. So I'll be doing a review on this figure hopefully soon. I have a backlog of figures that I've been wanting to do reviews for and I just haven't gotten to them. I just, it's getting home from work and just being tired. Like it's late me making this video right now and I want to hope this gets out soon. But yeah, guys, that's what I picked up. The main thing I wanted to show off was this. And when I get the other package, I'm going to have duplicates of these now. 
I will figure out what I'm gonna do with those. I'm not gonna sell them. That's one thing I will not do. I will not sell them. I might end up giving this guy away. I might do a contest and give him away when I do one of the videos for King Oger. I don't, I'm thinking of just doing like a mega video on this guy instead of trying to do a video on the main guy and then like the, I think I'm just gonna do a full video, like 40 minute video on the whole thing. If you guys want me to do a full video on King Oger, including this guy, or actually, yeah, including this guy and the other, if you guys want me to just do a full video on him, let me know in the comments down below guys. And also too, if you wanna see more He-Man uh, Revolution and Revelation video on toys, let me know. I will be doing a review on this show It'll be more like just the overall Netflix reimagination, reboot, sequel, whatever you're going to call it, to He-Man, Masters of the Universe on Netflix. I will probably do a full review on that on the uh, My Gen Planet at the Movies channel. So if you guys are interested and follow me there and I talk more about movies and TV shows there, let me know in the comments down below, guys. As always, if you guys enjoyed this video, check out this video right here. It's covering my face. That's okay. And as always, until next time.